In this video, I want to show you how to create Facebook ads using your mobile phone. Most people want to create Facebook ads using their mobile phone these days. And it sort of makes sense because everybody is using a mobile phone these days. So the first thing you need to do to create Facebook ads using your smartphone is to download an app called the Meta Ads or the Facebook Ads. So you need to go to your Play Store or your Android Store, your iOS Store and install the app. I'm going to link the app right here at the top of this video and I'm going to put the app link in the description for you so you can just get the correct app. After downloading this app, it's going to ask you to log in using your Facebook account. So it's going to pick out your Facebook automatically and then you can just proceed and log into your Facebook. So when you log into your Facebook, all your ad accounts, all your pages would be right here. So this is a fresh ad account, a fresh Facebook account that I just want to use to make this video. So right here, this is our ad account and we just want to come here where it says create an ad. So this is where you now pick your campaigns. It also helps you pick the Facebook page that you have in the account. So this is where you now pick your campaign objectives. If you want post engagement, where you want people to just engage with your post, you will go with this very first one here. If you want video views, you want to promote your videos, you want to, you want plenty of people to just see your videos, you can use video views. If you want to create a traffic campaign where you send people to your website, the third option will be for you. If you want to reach people, the fourth option will be for you. If you want to send, if you want people to send you DMs on Facebook Messenger, on Instagram, and on WhatsApp, then messages will be best for you. If you want to grow your page, if you want to grow your Facebook page to gain likes and followers, then the last option will be for you. For the purpose of this video, I just want to create an engagement campaign. So I just click on engagement. So after clicking on that, it's going to give me all the posts that I currently have on the page. All right. So I can just then select any of the posts that I want here and proceed. Or if I want to create a new post at this moment, I can come here where it says create post and I can just tap on it and I can just select an image and create the post. For the purpose of this video, I want to use an existing post. So I have to go back and from here you can equally pick the Instagram account that you have linked to the Facebook page. So you come here where you have the Instagram icon, you click on that and I do not have any Instagram connected to this page. So if I had the Instagram, the, the content or the post on the Instagram account will equally be available for me to pick from here. But since I don't have that, I have to proceed with what I have, which is go back to my Facebook page. And then since this um, post here does not have any test, I can edit the test. Or I can just scroll and find a particular post that I want to um, ed edit and use. So for the purpose of this video, I am just going to select this one. And then after selecting that one, I want to go to the next phase. So I come right here where I have this arrow and then I click on continue. So this is where we start doing our targeting and finding the audience. So you can target people who have liked your page before or people who liked your page and your friend and their friends. If you are a beginner and you don't have a lot of followers, do not use any of these because it's not going to come back to well for you. You want to come here and you want to create an audience. So if you come here where it says create an audience, you just click on edit an audience or edit the audience. And then this is where you start selecting the location. So you click on 
the location where you want this ad to show by coming here where it says include locations so you click on that and then you want to select the location so i want to select nigeria because i'm in nigeria so you can select anywhere you want and then you want to click ok so this is where you want to select your age so select the age range that you want so i'm just going to say 25 to 50 and this is where you select the gender if you want just men or just women you select anyone you want Try right here i'm going to leave it to both of them and this is where you start doing your detailed targeting all right you want to include people who meet a kind of a need for you so you can target people by their interest by their demographics or by their behavior these are the things that facebook allows you to target with so you can just come here and say let me say i want to target people who like football so i can click on football and then and i can just select as much pages as i want right here i'm doing this just for the sake of this video so you basically have your own idea of the people you want to um, target so you have different things that you can use to target right here so i'm just going to make this snappy this video is getting lengthy already so i click ok we want to continue so you can equally toggle this on which means that if facebook thinks that they should go outside of your targeting to reach people then they have the permission so if you toggle it on it means that they can bypass this your targeting but if you want them to stay around this targeting you turn it off all right so after this you want to go to the next phase and or you can just update this new um, audience that we've created or save them all right so let's just save them as new I want to name it so I'm just going to name it that and proceed so we want to go to the next phase and this is where you set your budget so you can set a daily amount or a lifetime amount so we just want to stick to daily because we want to be charged daily so you can come here and select the amount that you want so you can put any amount you want from one dollar and above so I'm just going to leave it to this all right so you want this ad to continuously run or you want it to run after you after a particular date so you can just toggle this off and if you want this ad to start the moment it has been approved you check this one if you want it to start later you can just click this one and then you set the date this simply means you are scheduling your ad to run at a particular time so I'm just going to check this one. You want to look at the delivery and for some reasons it didn't load. But the delivery just shows you what your ads or where your ads will show. But since we just have only Facebook, I think that's why it's failed. So we basically have everything um, set and it's saying here that our estimated um, the daily result is not available. But we can just proceed with that so once you have everything you need here checked you can just click go and then you can review your adverts right here you can see we selected um, post engagement you want to come and come down here and preview your ad so a preview of my ad is loading so we are just going to give it some time okay this is it right here so this is how your advert is going to appear to people who see it on Facebook. So the moment you are okay with this, you just click on place order and your adverts will go to review. So the Facebook team, they are going to review your advert and then approve it. If they don't approve it, you have to do the correction that they've asked you to do. And then you have to submit it again and they will approve your advert. So this is how to create Facebook ads using your smartphone. I hope this video helped you. Thank you for watching. Please like this video, subscribe to this YouTube channel, and I'll see you in my next video. My name is Good Noel. Bye-bye.